I'm Lizzie Capelli, I'm the campaign officer for the, this campaign, which is part of the Up and Forward project. You just need to see what the problem is, and that's why we need to talk with the community, that's why we're dropping in community groups, and we want to hear from them, we want to hear from them what they want, and then we plan the, the campaign around their needs. My name's Ellen Jackson, I'm an outreach worker at GMWDA. Uh, today we've got an event in Upton Stockport, uh, we're wanting to engage the community in t with recycling and reusing items. So we've got a few workshops going on, a few events going on throughout the day. Uh, to start with, we've got a food recycling event. So it's to do with food wastage. We've got Cracking Good Food coming in and they're doing a workshop. With cooking demonstration, showing people how to shop wisely, how to use food in a better way, healthy way. Between one and five, we've got a recycling bingo and a bling your bin event. We've got recycling bingo trying to just bring awareness to what goes in what bin. Uh, and then we've got the bling your bin, so we've got free bin cleaner, we've got a bin spray painter as well uh, to come down. Hopefully the community get engaged in that as well, have a chat to us, uh, just get to know the community a little bit. I'm Paul Chambers, I'm the owner of Big Fresh UK, which is part of Big Fresh Bins. Um, we're a cleaning and maintenance company and we're here to um, yeah, work with Greater Manchester Waste um, doing a bin cleaning clean up event. Um, so we'll be cleaning anyone's bins who wants a, a free clean today, uh, making them uh, wash, disinfect and deodorise, getting them nice and fresh. We've got some entertainment for the kids. So we've got fun bus and we've also got a face painter, balloon modeler, so hopefully it engages them. And then in the evening we've got a rock recycling youth club. So hopefully engaging 10 to 16 year olds. Uh, we've got a couple of workshops in uh, upcycling. Uh, and reusing clothing, so revamping them, make them new again, so it's worth wearing again. We managed to reach a quite wide audience who wanted to uh, target different age groups. In total, well, we had quite a few tonight at the youth club, there were about 50, 50 kids running around, and throughout the day, probably 200 people. and you just have to show them it's really, it's just getting into the habit of recycling and separating your, your waste and it's, as soon as you get how it works, it's so easy and so it becomes, it becomes actually an habit, you don't even think about that. 